Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. So in this video I'm going to be sharing some pieces that I have picked up for autumn. So I'm going to start with jumpers. The first one is from Arquette and it's this amazing, comfortable and cozy oversized knit. I love how oversized this is but I love that I'm able to wear this both casually and professionally. So I style this with a pair of heels in my previous workwear lookbook but it's great because you can also wear this every day and tuck it into your jeans which is something that I personally really like to do whether it's a shirt or a jumper. For reference I'm a UK size 8 and I have bought this jumper in a extra small to small. Moving on to my next piece and this is from Cezanne and I'm introducing a bit of colour and I do think that autumn is not restricted to just wearing darker and deeper tones. I think these light tones are really nice in this season too. So this jumper is from Cezanne, it's absolutely beautiful, it's not itchy at all. I have this in a size small and it is just so so comfortable and I think it looks so beautiful paired with jeans, I just love that blue on blue look. Cezanne is a brand that I am absolutely obsessed with at the moment, they have so many pieces that I just love and I really love their brand ethos as well. My next jumper is a very classic autumn staple and that's a simple camel turtleneck. This is from H&M, it's very affordable, it's about £19.99 and I have this in a medium because I wanted a slightly oversized fit but it cinches in at the bottom so it's not going to drown you at all but it's just such a classic staple. I get so much wear out of jumpers like this and for the price it is so soft and so comfortable. My next piece is from Zazan again and it's a very classic chic cardigan slash sweater. So you can actually wear this as a cardigan, you can wear it as a jumper with the buttons going down or you can wear it the other way around so you have a really beautiful boat neck sweater. This jumper is just so soft and I think that the design of this just really reminds me of my grandmother so that's why I love it so much. It's just like a really chic and classic timeless piece to have in your wardrobe and I can imagine myself wearing this for years and years. I am really building up a collection of Cezanne pieces. I have a few and they're just so durable and so wearable. This one is actually already sold out but I thought I would share it anyway because it might come back in stock. It's a very simple turtleneck but the beautiful thing about this jumper is the buttons on one side of the shoulder. I think that just makes it look so chic and so sophisticated and it's those finishing touches that I think make that piece really special. This is one of those pieces that you're just going to wear with absolutely everything and anything but I would really love to pair this with a jumpsuit on top. I think it would look really chic. Another classic staple is from our cat and this is a oversized merino jumper. I bought this in a medium because I wanted it to be slightly oversized. It's perfect because you can wear this right now whilst it's still a little bit warm outside but also when it gets too cold a month you can layer something like this with a shirt underneath or with another jumper or some thermals underneath. It's really just such a versatile piece. I'm really loving navy at the moment. I think it's just such a nice colour combination to wear with jeans and yeah I'd probably wear something like this with an oversized coat or I'd probably wear like a blue shirt underneath. Moving on to some pieces that I have missed a lot the past few months and that's outerwear. So I'm starting with this totem jacket. I wanted this for so long and I actually bought this a while ago because I knew I would wear it in autumn but also in spring and it's just a really nice camel wrap coat. It's a little bit expensive but I have found an amazing alternative that's a very affordable price so I will link that in the description box. This jacket has actually sold out now but sometimes you can get lucky and you might find it come back in stock. I get so many compliments on this when I wear it and I just think it would look so beautiful with a camel jumper or camel tones for autumn. I'm having a real love affair with blazers right now. This blazer is from And of the Stories. It's an oversized double breasted wool blazer and it's just got these really lovely autumnal tones going through it. I absolutely love the check print and I think it's just adding a little something different to any of the blazers that I already own. And it gets major points for having my favourite thing which is an inside pocket. It's also got a slight shoulder pad so it just gives quite a nice structured yet masculine feel to the blazer. I have this in a size 34 because I didn't want it to be too oversized so I would say stay true to your size if you want just a nice slightly oversized fit. 
So my next jacket is from H&M, it's a boxy navy jacket and I think something like this would look really beautiful paired with a really feminine skirt. So I have actually styled this with jeans as I have with most things in this video just so you guys can focus on the pieces. Yeah, I think it looks really cool, I love the tab detailing on it and it has this really cool grain texture which I think just makes it look a little bit more interesting. Because it's so oversized you could definitely wear this with a thick jumper underneath but when it gets a little bit chillier I have this in a size small and it is pretty oversized on me. Moving on to my next blazer, this is a blazer I have been wearing religiously, it's from Zara. I feel like I hadn't shopped there for a long time and then they launched a bunch of amazing pieces and this blazer has been one that I can't get enough of. It's got this really nice simple faint pinstripe and it's double breasted. It looks so sophisticated and so smart but it's just one of those pieces that you could wear with jeans or with trousers or with a dress, it's so versatile. I have this in a small because it's already pretty oversized and I want it to fit just perfectly. My next jacket pretty much screams autumn. It's from Cezanne. I wanted this jacket as soon as I saw it. It is absolutely beautiful. It's so soft. It's very oversized, so definitely stay true to your size. I kind of wish maybe I went a size smaller just because it's that big, so it kind of drowns me a little bit. But it is absolutely beautiful. The quality of this is amazing. You can really see the quality in Cezanne pieces and just the sheer attention to detail. It's finished so perfectly and I absolutely love the tones in this jacket. It is exactly what I was after and it really reminds me of the Chloe jacket from last year that I really wanted but was way out of my price range. And this is at a fraction of the price but Cezanne pieces are limited so if you like anything from Cezanne, honestly, grab it while you can. This blazer has made an appearance on my channel a few times already. It's another one from Zara and it's a really soft touch beige blazer, just such a classic staple. I've been really inspired by Rosie Huntington lately and this is a piece that she tends to wear quite a lot. So I really like wearing it with white trousers or a pair of black jeans or blue jeans. It kind of goes with everything and anything. And I absolutely love the fabric in this. I love that it is soft but also structured. So you definitely get that nice tailored feel. And again, I have this in a size small. So you might be a bit confused about there being a slip dress in this, but this is a dress that I actually bought for my birthday. But I realized that it would be perfect in autumn as well because it has that check print and I think check is such a beautiful print to wear during autumn months and winter. Although this is sleeveless, I have worn this with a cardigan over the top or you could wear a jumper underneath and it would look so chic. This dress is from Rixo and Rixo is a really cool brand. They have such amazing dresses and the quality of this dress is beautiful. It just flows so nicely and I just love the way that it hugs my body it really is the perfect slip dress so this is the part of the video that I am very excited about and I'm so excited to be partnering with Miss Soma on their latest collection so they've released a new collection called 1987 and they have created this with a influencer called Lucy Williams and she has such amazing style she's super cool and their pieces are beautiful it's got really nostalgic pieces I love gold and every piece in this collection has a gold finish I think these have got to be some of my favorite necklaces that I have ever worn I have been wearing it with everything since I've had them and the colour is just so beautiful. I actually have a few Misoma pieces and they're so durable and they have been lasting me for so long but Misoma is just such an amazing place to get jewellery from for everyday wear and yeah some of these pieces are just so classic they're so timeless. I think this has got to be my favourite collection that they have done. I really love the chain link details and I'm a sucker for a nice statement hoop earring so these are definitely a pair that I will be getting a lot of wear out of. I will be leaving links for all of these pieces in the description box, so if you want to have a look at them, definitely check them out. A couple of months ago, I went to go and look at the Dior saddle bag. It's one that I've had my eye on for a while, and I finally caved and bought it after a lot of thinking, and I absolutely love it. I went for the black medium saddle bag, and it's just the perfect everyday bag. You can wear it from day to night, and I just love how chic and sleek and sophisticated it is. And I really feel like it goes so well with the clothes that I wear and also the jewelry that I wear, and I think it's one that I will be wearing religiously for years to come. And that's everything. So so I hope you guys enjoy this video and if you want to see more videos from me don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!